letting them burn off some energy before you put them in the car. Yeah. yeah. What about food? They like <laughs> any kind of human food. They're both strict vegetarians, though. Doc Antle was moving his mammals down to South Florida for the winter. These guys had to be down there the next day for a presentation. Chimps aren't your typical transport. I mean, these guys don't go into a carrier. You don't put them into a box. You put these guys in the back seat with seat buckles. They ride in the truck with you. Crazy. These guys are like little children. Great times, man. This is like having five-year-old kids. At first, I thought it'd be just fantastic. We'd have a blast. Then it kind of got annoying, dude. These things are strong, 10 times stronger than humans pound for pound. Started getting a little bit out of control in the back, biting each other. WWF, insane. It's under control. You're gonna take care of it? <laughs> Whoops! They started jumping up into the front seat of the truck, and I mean, I could not have that when I was driving. Not only does it put us in danger, but other people on the road. So eventually we had to pull over. We didn't want to put these guys in the trailer, but we had to do something. We're going to put them in the trailer, and we left them alone in the truck. That freaking chimp locked the door. He locked that door and sat there like, yeah, now what are you gonna do? <laughs> Oh my God. You gotta be kidding me. Push this button right here. This one. <laughs> oh, there you go. So what we did is Rick had a great idea. He ran to a store. He bought a bunch of different toys, ropes, letters, block. We tricked this trailer out. I mean, we felt bad enough that they had to be in that trailer. We were gonna make it as fun as possible for them. We made it awesome for them. That was the best trailer ride they've ever had. Andrew, was that you? What? I smell something. Somebody's got a poopy diaper. Let's just get it changed so we can get on the road. And a lot of times Andrew risks his life and does these crazy things, but I definitely had my chance that time, man. He made me change the diaper on a chimpanzee and I had to do it. I took one for the team and I did it. No way this is gonna happen. I don't see any problems with this. And welcome to Skatori. Do you have a booth for four? Uh, you give me just a minute. We took these guys into an Italian restaurant. We had pizza with them, spaghetti. They sat there with us. I mean, that was insane. There was no way I thought that was going to ever work, but it did. I mean, it did start to get a little hectic, but it was a blast. Dude, I don't know if this is a good idea. I think we maybe should go. We finally got these guys loaded into the trailer. We, got, we hit the road, almost missed their presentation. We got there just in the nick of time. Andrew and I are a great team because he's the serious guy and when things need to get done, he's gonna get them done and on time and get paid. And I'm gonna make sure he has fun doing it. You're a superstar. 